remember when you said it doesn't get better than this. Only a fool to let you go. You got into my head. Am I about to lose myself? When will all of this fade away? 'Cause I see colors for the first time. I'm starting to realize nothing's ever black and white. And I'm caught up in the first night. Now it doesn't feel right. I just have to say goodbye. Range Rover Evoque gets significant updates for 2023. JLR has just announced that the Range Rover Evoque has undergone an update for 2023 with simplifications in the trim range and interior design changes inspired by the large Range Rover. Quoted in the Land Rover Media Room, Wednesday, June 21, 2023, one of the significant changes is the introduction of a curved infotainment touchscreen with a size of 11.4 inches, which has previously been used on the Range Rover Veeler and the new Land Rover Discovery Sport. All core functions, including climate control, have been integrated into the new display software, and the climate control panel that was previously located under the dash has been replaced with a storage compartment featuring a wireless charging pad. There are sidebars on either side of the touchscreen that provide easy access to important functions, so as much as 80% of tasks can be done with just two taps. Features like Apple CarPlay and Android Auto have also come standard, as well as Amazon Alexa voice control. Wi-Fi connectivity with a data plan allows the new Evoque to be updated over the air, eliminating the need to take it to the dealer to install new software. Additionally, there is also a remote app available that allows remote locking and unlocking, interior conditioning, and charge adjustment for plug-in hybrid models. Alongside digital enhancements, the updated Evoque cabin also introduces a new PM 2.5 air purification system, as part of the comfort pack, and various non-leather upholstery options, such as Kvadrat wool. According to the release, this wool material is 58% lighter than leather, but remains strong after 60,000 cycles of abrasion testing simulating a decade of wear and tear. Got into my head Am I about to lose myself? When will all of this fade away? Cause I see colors for the first time I'm starting to realize Nothing's ever black and white And I'm caught up in the first night Now it doesn't feel right I'll just have to say goodbye The powertrain lineup has also been revised, except for the entry-level D165 diesel variant with manual gearbox. All Evoque variants are now electrified, as either a 48 volts mild hybrid or a plug-in hybrid. 
Thanks to the new battery chemistry changes, the officially electric-only range of the P300 EPHEV has increased from 38 to 39 miles, 62 kilometers, meaning that for day-to-day -day use, electricity is sufficient. The P300 EPHEV variant is also equipped with DC fast charging capability, so charging time only takes 30 minutes at a 50 kW charge point. However, charging using a 7 kW point, like at home, takes about 2 hours to charge the 14.9 kWh battery. Meanwhile, the rest of the powertrain, including the D165 and D200 diesel engines, as well as the P200 and P250 petrol units, are all 48 volts mild hybrids with automatic gearboxes. The trim range has also been simplified to four levels, namely S, Dynamic SE, Dynamic HSE and Autobiography, and for the lowest price in the UK starting from £40,080 or around 767 million Indonesian rupees, for the non-hybrid manual D165 variant in S trim. Words are kinda hard to find, so I just had to write this song. I don't wanna see you cry again, and no matter how the story ends, I'll always be there for you. Cause I see colors for the first time, I'm starting to realize nothing's ever black and white. And I'm caught up in the first night, now it doesn't feel right, I'll just have to say goodbye one last time. I know that it's hopeless, but it won't be fine. Cause nothing's ever black and Thank you.